the Sun Queen grows old, soon she will choose her successor. I fear it will be me. I am now her favorite. She dotes on me, calls me her precious first daughter. Like a doll, she always keeps me close to her, brushing my hair, dressing me in her favorite clothes. It unsettles me beyond words, but more disturbing, she constantly gazes upon my features as if, as if she's looking at her own reflection. The endurance, they're tearing it apart. Portables last week. Are they powering fucking stadium lights? You should be quiet. Don't talk like this. Keep it steady. We're bringing it up. What do you what the going hell? On up the All that smoke rising over the mountain. If there was a problem, they'd call down. But what about the radio? Nothing but static all night. Something's going on. Brother, I told you to be silent. Stop this talk. Seriously fucked up is going on here. The natural phenomenon that causes the weather to go ape shit, a military research base, some kind of sun queen, and a crazy cult. I mean, if I didn't know better, I'd say this is a big put on. You know, TV cameras hidden in the trees. I mean, you know, I, I gotta admit, it's scaring the shit out of me. I, I keep cracking jokes to cover it up. Reyes looks ready to kick my ass. I think I need to do something useful before I completely lose it. I wish I could be more like Lara. She just... <laughs> she blows me away. Not only is she brilliant, but she's also an amazing ass-kicker. 
If she didn't notice me before, she sure as hell won't now. But maybe I can still do something to get her attention.
legs! Oh God, I've got to get in there. Alex! I'll have you out of there soon! All right, now to clear the way. Now! 